What is going on, everybody? My name's Jacob Forster. Welcome back to the room for Old Sins. We have this super cool dollhouse of mysteries, puzzles, and curiosities that we are going through at the moment. I've already finished the foil down here, and we've opened up a few other locations. This is the brand new one that we haven't entered yet. Uh, we've done a bit up here in the, I think it's the laboratory, and we have a kitchen down here, which we recently got the pump going, got some water filled up. If you want to know, <laughs> go watch the last episode, that will get you all caught up. But we're going into this brand new area. I'm going to try to keep these videos at about an hour in length, just, just as a good kind of sit down watching time. Ooh, the curiosity room. This looks really cool. Um, oh my goodness. All right, so we've got a lot of hidden things going on. Uh, I don't even know where I should start first. I guess we'll go to the centerpiece. And I can't forget, I have this strange enamel fragment and a fire steel, which I didn't get a chance yet to, oh, to uh, look at the comments of the last video. Uh, so I don't know what the fire steel is still. I guess we'll find out as we keep going. Interesting, we've got this opening here, this kind of metal work along the side bunch of like wheels looks like something may be able to slot in like right here even I'm just looking at the side pieces oh and we've got some type of a crank can't access you yet interesting oh my gosh all right uh ooh, specialize with the globe so maybe we can bring these things here get to see something cool I don't know are those supposed to be like clouds moving? Or is that the space, space dust? I don't know, I have no idea. Okay. Interesting. Got a lot of those. So maybe I need to slot a piece into there and then we can bring it to the weird little thingy. Wait, hold on a second. I think there was just one other thing right here. Oh, I can't even zoom in on it. Interesting. Okay, so the, the globe is giving us nothing. <laughs> Absolutely nothing so far. Who are you? Little anatomy guy? You're pretty cool looking. What can I do with this? So nothing is on yet. So let's move up here. So there's some type of a combination each point of the triangle is going to be a different symbol, I'm assuming. And then, what's going on with your face, dude? Nice eyeball. Ooh, part of the model's forehead is missing. Okay, got it. So he's gonna be able to listen to something, I'm assuming? So strange, such a strange little thing. Okay, we got the picture up here, something way over here. Interesting mask. Okay. So what am I supposed to... Oh. Oh! <laughs> He's angry! <laughs> the bottom part of the mask is missing something. Oh, okay. It looked like I just moved it a little bit, though. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So am I matching up to this side? <laughs> that was perfect. Um, It's got angry eyes. And... Staplers facing towards the eyebrow and away from the eyebrow. That's that's what I'm using this as. Towards the eyebrow, away from the eyebrow. And then what else are we missing here? Oh, it's the chin. The chin is what we're missing, or some type of a necklace of it. But other than that, all the other pieces are set up properly. We've got Hugo Waldergrave over here. And I'm realizing I have not seen another book yet. Maybe we'll find that shortly. Oh, ah, a piece of a map, cool. So that's gonna help us. And then what are you? There's a label here, but no object, interesting. Can I can I see what the label is so I know what to put down there? I guess not. Okay, I wish I could zoom in on the handprint, but it doesn't seem like that's an option. Ah, our special book. Let's hear more of this. Weird story. The Compendium of Curiosities. Dr. L. Uh, Kung? 
Jones and Professor D something. Okay, let's get this goopy smoky book open. <laughs> Take a read. My husband is a stranger now. That man in the study is not him. What is this place? Was it once my home? It twists and writhes. I retreat to the attic, my childhood refuge. The dollhouse that father built was a world within a world. It seems so fragile now, so tiny. I see the crack in the floorboards. I remember spying on father in his study. It is my husband's study now. It takes a while for my eyes to adjust, to make out his hunched form. He works as if in a trance. I copy symbols, sketch apparatus, record all I can. I still have friends at the Royal Institute. They will hear of this knoll. Oh, Edward. Hmm, strange and interesting. No, I don't want to go to the book. <laughs> I want to go to the handprint, but I guess not. Ah, so this is probably the solution for our little friend over here once we get this thing turned on. So in the meantime, we all want, oh, I think there's one more thing right here. So what is, what is this? Any piece of a moon? Very distinct shape. It's obviously not that. And until I get that going, I don't think I'll be able to open this. So to the globe we go. Let's see, which part is this? I have no idea. <laughs> Interesting. Oh, wait. Ah, okay. So hexagonal with the dashes in between. That's what I need to find. Which is you. Okay, perfect. Slot you in. And then we should be able to look at this with our special eyes then. That's my guess. Ooh! Ooh, this is cool. You go there. Ah, I see, I see. Bring you over here. Oh, interesting. Oh, interesting. So we cannot move some of these other parts. So I guess I just have to keep moving you until we're here. And then we can move this over here. And then move you up to here. And up into the circle. Sweet. Ah, okay. So now it moves. We have another piece. Piece of a map. Cool. And I'm wondering now. No, don't go back. <laughs> Darn. I was going to see if maybe I could access that after opening it, but I guess not. So this one needs to be hexagon with a triangle shape in the middle, which is you. Slot you right into there. Perfect. Get you up. We can go down here. Are these the structures from Mars? This feels like these are the structures from Mars. Oh, weird. Hold on. <laughs> okay. Interesting way to go about this. Very interesting. Huh. Oh, oh, okay. So you can move that forward and backwards. Got it, got it, got it. This makes a lot more sense now. Now we can go down and around. Let's rotate this till we get back to here. Bring it forward again. Now we go up and over. This is cool. I like I like these ones. These ones are just generally fun. Oh, okay. Oh no no no. <laughs> Don't rotate, please. No, stop it. <laughs> okay, up and over. Move you to here. Should be able to go around. And put you in the center. And that's our next piece. Sweet. All right, so what is this going to open us? Open up for us, then. <gasps> the bottom of the mask. Okay. Cool. Carved piece of wood. Love it. Okay, so the this thing is still stuck down there, but I can go over here. Everything else is in the correct position. All we need to do is slot this right here. Ha ha ha! Cool. Perfect. All right, we've got our piece of a map, and then this looks like a strange mechanism. Something must fit on this bracket. Oh, weird. Okay. We'll figure that out 
at a later time, I guess. Uh, next part of the map. Okay. Interesting. Ah, Tropic of Cancer. So it's going to be... What is that, the lower half? Or is that the upper half? I guess that's the upper half. So what is it? Tropic of Cancer? Trop, Tropic of Capricorn? I don't know. <laughs> I don't remember. Don't, don't come at me! Don't come at me! Leave me alone. <laughs> okay. So how do we move this? Oh. Very interesting. Very, very interesting. Ah! The old flip <laughs> Okay, up and over. Up and over. Uh, flippity floppity. Get you here. This is great. This is great. I love this. And then swoop dee. Swoops. Uh, come over here. Get you into the center. And then all the way to the top. Cool. What do we get from this? <gasps> Finally, we get to pull the plunger. <laughs> is it just a pull or is it a twist? It's a pull, okay. Ah. Oh? Oh, ho, ho, cool. Laser puzzles. This is great. Looks like these rotate something. I'm assuming they need to go like that. Oh, you can move these. Oh, you move these all over the place. Okay. So, I would need one. Wait, what does this do? I'm sorry. Oh, it teleports it? <laughs> That's kind of wild. Um, so, yeah, we'll move this to here. Uh, no. No. Yes? No. No, no, no. Hmm. Interesting. Very interesting. Um. I think I I think I see what I need to actually do. Uh. Oh no, maybe not. So there's only two that are. Or there's only one of each of the bottom left and a bottom right piece. There's two top right pieces. This guy, though, might help me do something. Oh, wait a second. No. Because I need it to shine into this piece. Hold on. <laughs> We're figuring it out. Because again, this 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 piece will not work with this. This one will not work with this. This one will not work with this. So we have to start with this. Oh, I see. We're gonna make it come in from this side, I believe. Yep, yep. You're gonna go here, and then you're gonna go here. Got it. Got it. Got it. Cool. That's fun. That's very fun. What did that do for me, though? What rewards do I get? Ooh. That's a pretty cool mask. Anubis mask. All right. Sweet. Was that all the pieces of the globe? Yeah, I guess we're done with it. Look at you. Yeah, so that's what fits in that slot that we opened up. Just back here, next to the other masks. Toss it in, see what happens. Well, it's a lot bigger than I thought. Spooky? Oh, very spooky. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> ah, yes, a diamond. A gemstone, thank you. Thank you, Anubis. Appreciate it. What do we have here? So... Um... What do I do with you? <laughs> Did that go down here? No, that's the moon shape. Um. Hmm. Gemstone. Where does the gemstone go? 
goes in here with the other gems, obviously. I just realized that. Shmeep. Cool. <laughs> An iron. <laughs> An ornate iron, in fact. Incredible. Nothing else with these books. No hidden compartments. What's down here? Nothing at all. Uh, why do I have an ornate or uh, iron? <laughs> Let's flip the switch. Oh, flip this switch. What? <laughs> this is very bizarre. Huh? Oh, oh, okay. Hold on. So how do I get these to move? It looks like I can move it over. Hold on. Weird. Very weird. Okay. Um. Oh, they're stuck in place. I can't move them further now. So how am I supposed to rotate this? Uh, or get these guys to move? Did I break it? Can it shift over to the left? Um. Oh, that's how you do it. Okay. Got it, got it, got it. Now we should be able to pull it out. A metal handle. Cool. Oh, that's cool. Fire. Fire. So does that go back to the kitchen that might go back to the kitchen let's go check let's go take a quick look see see what we can figure out and find because i know there was the handle down here the kitchen no no it's already got a handle it's a very s that is almost the same handle though so that means we are in the right place do you go here? Oh, you do go here. Oh, cool. Sweet. And what is this? A little, little mechanism? Oh my gosh, that's, oh, that's the fire thing. Oh. Oh my gosh, it is a flint. Oh, okay. Got it, got it, got it. Well, that's really cool. Nice toasty fire burning. How does that fix? Oh, okay. Got it. A valve handle. Sweet. So that's the Y shape that I need in here. <gasps> oh, okay. Oh, so that diverts the water away from here somewhere else. Yeah. And that's going to go upstairs now. No. Maybe? No, yes it does. It makes steam. It's exactly what I thought. It's it's a steam machine upstairs. It's what we're creating. Oh cool. This is oh this is so cool. This is so cool. I love how it all comes together like this. Awesome. Let's leave. We haven't finished the kitchen quite yet, but we're getting there. Okay, come inside. Oop. Oh. Into the laboratory. No, sorry, the study. My bad. Okay, so now the steam is moving. Can I just put you down? Oh, I can. Flippy that. Ah! So we'll lock you into place. And now that's moving. So... The metal's too hot to touch. Oh, I get it, I get it. Okay, so which way do I want this to turn? I think either way is fine. So if we turn it like this, it'll uh, be like used as some type of a propulsion, right? Yes, yes. And that should unlock this thing for us. That's so cool. That's so cool. All right, now we can move this over. Uh, this way. Yeah. Ooh, okay. A pipe connector. So, does that go 
obviously onto here. So let's turn this off. <laughs> it's going absolutely crazy. Now we can make these all face upward. Connect you to here. And now flip it back. We connect this down and it will latch in. So where does that... Oh, that goes to the other machine, which gives us the new artifact, right? Yeah, yeah. I don't know how much I need to do over there, but we're getting it moving, so this is perfect. This is great. Oh, this is great. <laughs> do I just grab the piece? I do. Strange artifact. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> we gotta go. Oh, this is so cool. And there it is, all gross and goopy. <laughs> so, this next seal is going to break. Does that mean I'm going to get a new place that opens up? I'm assuming so. This one, maybe? No, over here. Okay. Cool. Study complete. A room dense with obsession. Study can be a refuge or a prison. I have walked free of its bars, but my task remains. Break the seal, find the null. Let's continue. So fun. So very fun. Some of the thunder. Thunder in the rain. So cool. Alright, so let's uh let's take a look at you, figure out what I'm supposed to do. Oh, just hold it down, I guess. <gasps> the moon piece! Okay, I know exactly where you go, sir. A little moon emblem. Where was that? Yes, up here. To the the curio room, the curiosity cabinet. <laughs> Yes, curiosity room. There we go. Uh, moon. Down here in the bottom right. Slot you in. Boop. Oh, eyeball. Artificial eye. Cool. Does this break free? <gasps> Special eyes. Oh. Ooh! That's cool looking. How do I get in there? I'm so confused. <laughs> Maybe I need to put a real one in there. Okay, either way. Sir, do you... Do you want an eyeball? No. He does not. No idea. Um, <laughs> let's figure this out. Are there symbols relating to what's on his chest? No. Again, that's a heart diagram. There's like a like a deer skull. Hold on, I messed this up last time. Let me just for sure make sure I can't click on this handprint area. No, absolutely not. We finished with that over there. You're done picture. I can't do anything with it. it is swirly? Hmm. I'm trying to think where else I might be able to use an eyeball. Also, a strange enamel fragment. Enamel. I feel like by chance, this would be used for this, but I don't think it actually is. It's the problem. And again, the only eyeball... I didn't inspect it first. I should have done that. The only eyeball that I see that's a direct match... Oh, an enamel piece! Oh! <laughs> I'm a dummy. Okay, there we go. There we go! 
<gasps> tiny room. Tiny puzzle room. Let's go in. Cool. Very cool. Are we inside of his mind? Oh, this is interesting. Oh, so is it freed now? Oh, that's really cool. That's that's super cool. Yeah, let's uh Yeah, there it is. A model weather vane. Alright, so we gotta take that outside now. Got it. Oh, that was really cool. So does that belong on this? I, I doubt it. No, 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 no. Model weather vane. Oh, you fit up here. On top of the tower, maybe? No, probably not. No, no, no. Weather vane. Does that go on the very tippity top, maybe? Let's see what the bottom looks like. Mmm, okay. It's like a four peg hole. Uh, hmm. Structure looks incomplete. Yeah, so there's something that goes here. Four pegged hole. Oh, what is this? Oh, I saw this earlier. I don't know where that go what would do with that. Oh, here we go. Ah, uh, gotcha. Beep. Should open a new room then, hopefully. South. Flip it. Okay, so there's a few of these. Uh, next one is east. Okay, set you to east. <laughs> cool. Flippy. Okay, where is west? I would assume it'd be on this side. It's very tiny, so. Oh, here we go. What is that, north? Yep. Okay, so let's get north going. Mm, no, 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 hold on. There we go. North. And you were right here. Let's get that one flipped. Oh, is that it? No. And then... Oh, I heard you. I don't know where you are. Oh, there you are! Oh, you were so hidden away. Okay, so that's the last piece. Love it. Love it. Hmm. I wonder what room that is. Also, hold on. What is going on on the side here? Just now seeing this. Weird. Okay, I'll, I'll have to keep that in mind for anything that I might find. Let's uh, break into this room. The maritime room. Okay. Let's check for weird symbolism. We got some down here. Something over here, around the safe. More triangles on the floor. Haven't figured out what's going on with the triangles. And then this is like a little service elevator. It's kind of cool. It has the special eyes with it. Interesting. Okay. Very cool. So, can I open you now? Oh, no, I send you back back down to be used somewhere. Uh, I think in the kitchen. Okay, uh, small submarine handling manual. Okay, let's check this one out. I know by feel that this letter is different. The endless demands for progress are light. This has weight, terrible, ominous weight. I watch the contents spill across my desk, the detailed notes, the sketches of my apparatus. There's no mistaking the artist. 
My wife and the betrayer is herself betrayed by her own hand. Poor naive Abigail. How could you possibly believe the circle would not be watching? They have me now. There will be no more delays. Ooh. Okay, can I turn this on? No power. Got it. So that's what the, the dummy down is going to be listening to. Downstairs? Somewhere downstairs. Is this a Gatling gun? <laughs> no, it's a telescope, isn't it? Actually, I don't know what this is. It seems like some type of a cannon-esque thing. Interesting. So obviously I gotta aim it at that and then shoot whatever Okay, come back to you later. Is this a weird submarine? Submarine fundamentals, ascending and descending. Oh, okay. So we've got handprints and looks like one of the portals. And it looks like we're missing a piece of the side here. Oh. Ah, okay. So yeah, we can ascend or descend, but again, I need the side piece. Interesting. Yeah, the front is missing. Okay. Come back to you at a later point. And then this looks very complex. Will I be able to do anything though? Looks like maybe a crank can go here so that I can rotate. Oh, look at that. Look at the details of the little barnacles around the safe. Like they pulled it out of the deep ocean. That's really cool. That's really, really cool. Okay, so there's no current way to rotate you, unless there's something on the top or sides or the back. Okay, yeah, there's a lot. There's a lot more. Zoom in. Oh, there's the next artifact. Okay. So what do I do with these guys? Doesn't seem to be anything at the moment. Let's check this side first. And again, there's... A gear missing. Got it. So then the back piece. <laughs> Let's clean up the glass. It's great. I like this squeaky little. <laughs> it's amazing. What a nice little touch to this silly little thing. Okay. Cool. So can I take the gear then? Uh, what am I doing? Oh, down there. Oh, I see. It's a propeller. Ah, propeller for our little submarine, I'm assuming. Let's go check that out. Because I doubt it goes onto the safe itself. Propeller would go in the back here. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Cool. <gasps> Tiny puzzle! Tiny puzzle! <laughs> awesome. We're inside the sub. We're inside Iron Lung. Let's go! <laughs> uh, specialize first. Nothing suspicious. Nothing out of the ordinary. Let's check out what this is. Mechanical submarine, engineered and manufactured. British Nautical Engineering Limited. Ah, the other piece. Cool, the metal fin. Perfect, so that should be all of the pieces of the actual sub. And then obviously based on where we are going either up or down, grapnel control. Got it, okay, so you go down grab things from down below. Interesting that we can't interact with that. So that's the main control center. So maybe the door won't open until we are further up into the air and have ascended. That's my guess here. So put you here. Oh, oops. You know what, that might 
work. Let's let's try that real quick. Because maybe the arm can grab something at the door. Since it's tilted. <laughs> yeah, cool. And it'll just break it open. Oh, sweet! Sweet. That's really cool. Okay, so what do we do in here then? We're doing some navigating? What is this? Ah, oh, a vacuum tube. Perfect. Oh, another book. Ocean Navigation, a concise guide. I didn't think I'd find two books in the same general location, but this is cool. Let's see what it says. I find Edward in, in Father's Curiosity Room, and it is like the sun dawning. I feared he would never leave that study again. I see the pages in his hands, crumpled, torn, unmistakably mine. I try to explain, but his eyes look clean through me. I warn him, plead with him, but he's deaf to me. He says I have betrayed him. I have darned us both, destroyed his work, both our lives. I can sense it through him now. The wrongness, the taint I felt outside the study door. In this moment, I know my Edward is gone and no help is ever to come. I have only one choice. Mm, so ominous. <laughs> All right, um, so let's take a look at our map here. Specialized? Mm-hmm. I've got zero bearing on where I actually need to go. So I'm not even going to attempt to mess with this first. And I'm also assuming I need to tilt this back upwards since we already got the door open. Because we're probably going to look into the sky. Out somewhere out there. So that seems cool. Yeah. Vacuum tube goes here with the little sound system. Fun fact, vacuum tubes are still currently used on a lot of guitar amplifiers. Uh, tube amp is what they're called. And these tubes give a natural warmth and kind of a natural distortion as well, which is really cool. Fun facts. It's going, like, extremely slow. Interesting. Uh, I'm going to go back down to the dummy in the curiosity room. Yes, because that's where that's coming out of. So maybe he's going to give us a better way to hear it? That's my guess. Oh, it looks like I can mess with this. No. Hmm. Interesting. Very interesting. Okay. So nothing, nothing to do with that yet. Let me go back into the nautical room. I'm going to go back into the sub now that I've tilted it upwards. Maybe that will give me something else to mess with. Okay. In we go. Back through the sub. No, there's not really anything I can see here. Hmm. 
Hmm. And again, nothing nothing with our special eyes. Okay, yeah, so there's there's not much here for me at the moment. The claw is already finished, doesn't need to do anything else. Actually, let me let me just see what happens if I do the claw down here. No, absolutely nothing. Okay, that's fine. And then my only other potential guess is to straighten it out. So let's see if anything else happens due to us straightening it out. No, nothing I can see. Darn. Okay. All right, let's let's exit out. <laughs> So this is the last piece of the puzzle that I got. Is this a tuning thing up here? No. There's gotta be something else in here that I can figure out. Go through real quick. Listening. Okay, so it's definitely stuck at the 80 cycle. Oh, 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 I totally forgot about you. I totally forgot about you. Okay, so you are directly below into the kitchen. So there should be a, uh, a weight, um, uh, the wait, the 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 waiting elevator, the waiter elevator. Yeah, down here. Okay, okay, okay. got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Now we can open you. Oh, I forgot you were in here. <gasps> Anatomical heart, an artificial heart. Let's go. Okay, so now we can go to the dummy. Got it, got it, got it. Almost forgot. Almost forgot I did that. <laughs> this is why I should always focus on just one little puzzle at a time, and not overwhelm myself trying to go too far ahead. Once I like <laughs> see something, I'm just like, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Where do I go next? <laughs> oh crap, where do I put you? Wait, I don't have the solution for this to open up his chest. What? <laughs> what? Oh my gosh, N. Oh, what? Okay. All right, so bottom right is the N or Z. It's that one. Oh, this is this is cool. I didn't know there was a, just a little switch there. That's really funny actually. Next one is here. So I'm looking for anomalous uh, pieces. The weird E. Which is you. Okay. And then we get the last piece. No, no. You want to go up. Upsies. And here we go. I got another spot on his pelvic bone. Okay. And the I is the top piece. Got it. Or H, whatever you want to call it. Cool. Cool. Awesome. So let's slot you into here. And then all we need to do is go back to the image here to figure out what we need to do. So from left to right, so down, up, down, up, up, down. It's so down, up, down, up, up, down. Down, up, down, up, up, down. Um, oh, down, up, down, up, up, down. Yeah, okay, cool, cool, cool. I <laughs> thought I messed, messed that up for some reason. And now his voice box is going to record what we need. <laughs> oh, weird. <laughs> it's such weird, but such cool imagery. Individuality. 
Intellect, perception, perfect. I didn't even read these. Intuitive ability, reflective reasoning, humanity, intention, locality, time, tune, force, joy, human nature, amical, begin, expand, construct, acquisitiveness, appetite. There we go. Ah! Camera! Thank you. Now we've got our sub-coordinates. Okay, north five. Sweet. Alright, where, where are you taking us for this one? West 85. So 585. 585. 585. Okay. 585. 585. 585. 585. Five eighty five five West eighty five. Yes, eighty five. Eighty, no, eighty five. There we go. Spooky. Spooky. <gasps> Very spooky indeed. Oh. Oh, look at this. Am I navigating through here? Oh, oh, oh. What is this? Hold on. What are you? How do I how do I interact with you? Or am I not supposed to? I'm confused. <laughs> okay, let's 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 look around. Hi. Oh, okay. Down a little. Stop, 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 stop. Uh, yeah, there we go, there we go. Oh, cool, cool. So that rock was uh, a fake. <laughs> nice shipwreck down there. Is that it? I guess that's it for now. <gasps> no, we're opening this up to get an artifact of some sort. Glad I straightened out the sub, by the way. <gasps> the goop. Oh, all right, little arm, let's get you into the goop. <laughs> See what you find down there. That goes really far. All right, pull it back up. What do you got? Oh. Oh, this is from the first game? Second game? Third game? One of the games. Pendant with a map design. Um, this uh, goes on the, the front of the ship. We had a tiny ship um, that had that same same thing. Okay, I know exactly where that goes, so that's perfect. You go right up front onto this thing. It matches, but it doesn't connect. I should take another look at the pen. Ah, oh, okay, got it, got it, got it. I see. 
I like the like marble coloration. Oh, a pearl. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> well, thank you, Mr. Pearl. Okay, now I can slot you here. Is that gonna open a new, the attic maybe? Or something. Oh, interesting. Quite the cabinet of curiosities there. Oh, ooh. Weird. Oh, super weird. All right, let's go back into here and figure out what's going on with that. I have all time. My lens, my special eyes. We dive deeper into this puzzle. This looks like we have something to pull at the top. Shweep. Y'all like my sound effects? Shweep. Oh, excuse you. Hi, Mr. I. This is cool. This is very cool. Ah. Interesting. What? What am I doing? What? I'm <laughs> so confused right now. Um. <clears throat> so right now it's activating this one. So this one's supposed to face to the right. Is that what I'm getting out of this? Yes, that's what I'm getting out of this. Okay. This one is supposed to be facing to the left. This one is supposed to be facing to the right. Again, I hope this is correct. I love how I can just hear the guy talking on the, the radio in the background. Got it. This one's facing to the left. And then the last one. Facing to the right. Got it. Okay, cool. Sleep tight, big eyeball. Sleep tight. <laughs> oh! Oh, okay. We're, we're just getting it for this one already. Fantastic. So that's a uh, strange artifact. Sweet. Oh, I really like this room. I'm sad to see it end so 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 quickly. But then again, it is very nice to have some concise puzzles throughout this particular room. Oh, so cool. So cool. All right, and the next piece up here is going to be completed. Maybe the top or the bottom? Bottom, okay. Slowly gooping it up. Curiosity room complete. Darkness is darkness, no matter which corner of the globe it creeps from. The room is closed, but only just. True evidence that one's curiosity can be one's undoing. Ooh. <laughs> so deep. <laughs> okay, so let's take a look at the new thing that we just acquired. Go ahead and press the button. See what's inside for us. Curiously engraved device. Let's open it up. Huh. Oh. Ah, so the knight needs a sword. You. What do you need? I guess this is the, like, Lady Justice. What are you? It's it's hard to see it, like, upside down. Oh, you have the bow. You're like a Arthur. You're reaching out. And then you swap with you. Cool. An engraved model roof. Oh, okay. Got it. Just, that doesn't go up here, though. No, it goes... Oh, I know where it goes. It goes down 
here. No, not here. What is this? <laughs> There's nothing leading up the balcony. I didn't even know that was a thing. I need to put you here. The gazebo needs a roof. That's cool. That is very cool. <gasps> ah, we get to go to an outer outside world. Ooh, ooh. You know what? This looks very, very exciting, but this is, I think, a perfect spot to leave this video. So we've done one, two, and three rooms out of eight. Out of the three that are complete, we also have three, four, five, six that are open to us, uh, which means there's only two more areas that have not yet been revealed. And obviously, five more that need to be complete, which we've already gotten through a good chunk of these other ones. So I think, again, this is this is a great spot to leave this video. Um, let's go ahead and go back to our main menu. Yes, I am absolutely sure. Give me this sweet music. There it is. Woo! <laughs> very excited, very excited to continue playing through the room for old sins and excited to share more of this puzzle adventure with you all. Um, yeah, that's it. That's all I got to say. <laughs> So if you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit that like button. Leave a comment down below. Love to hear any thoughts and feelings from you all. If you're not already subscribed, consider doing so. Hit that bell notification that we know exactly when I'm uploading any new videos. And if you'd like to see any more content from me, you're welcome to follow me on any of my other socials like my Twitch, Twitter, Instagram, We've got a Discord channel, and a bunch of other cool things always listed in the description down below. But of course, that all being said, you all are awesome. You all are amazing. And I cannot wait to see you all in the next video. Later.